Mustafa Assal, the number eight seed from Egypt, taking on Diego Elias, the number seven seed from Peru. Diego Elias, in the back of his mind, he will know that Assal has spent just under four hours on the court in his three matches, whereas Elias, in contrast, has spent just over two. So you'd have to say that and from out. a physical standpoint, two, one. the edge would ever so slightly go. Setting Elias up a little bit. Sorry, setting Assal up. Everything seems to be either quite high on the front wall from Elias or it's clipping the side wall first, which then completely takes the, the sting out of the ball. At the moment, Assal straight hitting has been way more accurate. Started to move Assal around the court quite nicely here now. Possibly a little too little too late. But some good investment. Straight into him. Stroke to Assal. Oh, he's oh, gone straight don't into like him that. There. He's gone for the man. He's gone for the man and not for the ball. Ah, oh, it's brilliant. Aggression, speed and of movement, power. Three. Well, there it is, Bish. <laughs> Came out with it, the leisure centre boast. Clever. Yeah, it's a good play, unfortunately. Clever. The Peruvian Puma. Goodness oh, me, these are heavy movements. Yeah, you can't put it there. You cannot put it there. Leads to games to love. Stuff for a sale. Too, too strong. Really starting to open up the front of the court now, a sale. It's another appeal. He's come right off it physically. He had a, a battle royale with Paul Cole yesterday. Down. Then asked for the three minutes, PJ. <laughs> so in between games, Ooh. it's like the two no minutes left. and then the three minutes. Player review, yes. Elias, on the no left decision. This is the best angle. He's on his way up there, Joey. He is on his He's way on up his there. He's on his way. He is on his way up there. So, yeah. yeah. Stroke to Elias, decision overall. 11 3, game to Elias. Really, really up for it there. Yeah, that's a good touch. And out. 1 3. Yeah, it's one of the better rallies that we've seen. Keep a very close eye on that, Mr. Barrington, aren't you? Very much so. Well, he's giving two. up the ghost. Game to Elias. Two games so, all. the Peruvian Puma responds again. Haven't seen an error from a cell. Oh, look oh, at no. that. That's big. That was, that's brave. That was oh, that <laughs> you know, it was mid court. And that came out of nowhere. Oh, he's... It, it, oh, my word! It's unbelievable. Has he got that, PJ? That was like a break dancer. And he's won the rally. I mean, that's just outrageous. Maybe <laughs> could have actually gone for the stroke. Unbelievable. Honestly, the clearance there was beyond impressive. Where has he got that from? I don't know. Well, Mustafa Asal has done it. Three games to two. 
he's done it. 11-7. What a battle. Honestly, PJ, that was pretty really fascinating. I mean, we went back and forth. We're talking about second and third wins, fourth wins, having a bit of a chat there. There's some great stuff in that. Really fantastic. I mean, 20 years of age, he's come back from there. He looked like he was... It was dead and buried at 7-2 down in the fifth. He was very flat. There he's going to unleash his emotions. Oh, Gilly looks slightly frightened. <laughs> monster, monster match, just shy of 100 minutes. 3-2 victory, Mustafa Asal taking it 12-10 in the fifth. <laughs> we were just we were just re quickly remarking about that. You probably can't remember it, the break the break dancing move that you did, where you actually <laughs> hit the deck, spun round to get out of the way. It was unbelievable. <laughs> it was going to be a stroke, I think. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm so happy to be through. I can't imagine like I'm seven two down, and uh, you know after two love my body like has been flat and flat, you know, and uh, I think that's the effect from what happened you know yesterday as well I'm trying to recover and trying to give it more than 120 percent you know I'm coming this tournament not having the pressure that I have in any tournament because I'm having something in my my shoulder so you are relaxed and you are playing without any tension and any pressure so that's a good uh, it's a good feeling to be through yeah Joel making of Wales take your Tariq moment the number four seed of Egypt Nice to get that first point on the board when you come to these major semi finals and he's absolutely rolled one. He's enjoying life. Yeah. Tight moment. 11 9, game to Mortman. Mortman leads one game to love. Let's out a roar. Takes the first game. Impressive, very impressive. He's shortened the rallies up. He's Ten starting four, to find his racket work again, making. Down. Well, the error coming from moment. He 11, looks five, mentally making, unsettled. Joel making. He's got his foot in the door in this semi final. Tight work again from making. It's a real battle of that front left hand corner. This is one of the longer rallies we've had in quite some time, PJ. Done it again. Yeah, he's hit the ball with. Front, front left onto the back right. Would you think he should be using height there? 100%. Hand out 6 4. He's done that quite a bit. 10-8, game ball. Oh! Well, the screen there for a moment. moment. To there, see, it just yeah, stops it the movement, yeah. just breaks the movement up a little bit. That weird, it's been his undoing really. When he's wanted to change it, Joel making. This is a tough, tough rally. Moment needs to 
Just keep the ball out of the tin. from the backhand front corner and from deep hitting cross court to the forehand, shallow width. Oh, oh my word, that's a great shot. Straight hitting from John Makin. He's done it. 11-7, game to Makin. This at the moment, he's, as per usual, sending the ball into the front. It's ridiculous that he does it from so high up there. Wow. That was absolutely brilliant from Joel Makin. Good rally for a moment. Oh. Well, Tariq Mohamed scored it. Match to Morgan, three games to he's two. absolutely exhausted and he's going to have to back it up tomorrow. Stafra Sol's on his eighth game of FIFA in his hotel room. Joel Makin, what a performance 11, from him. 9, 5, 11. So ignore that, it was actually 98 minutes. Tarek moment overcoming Joel Makin, three games to two. We're going to hear from Tarek and Gilly down at courtside. Tarek, Joel never makes it easy. Up 2-1, came back in the fourth. How were you able to hold your mental edge in that fifth? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> He's, uh, he's unreal. I mean, uh, he never gives up. It's one of the best qualities he has, and no one, I don't think anyone on tour has this quality. The way he fights, despite being extremely tired and fatigued, is just unreal. He actually, like, the way he was fighting kept me going. Like, I was like, look, look what he's doing. Look, look how hard he's pushing. You need to push hard as well. And uh, I think he just lifted me up today. And uh, eventually, we, we gave you guys a two-hour match. I don't know how long it was, but... <laughs> Is it midnight? Almost, almost. <laughs>